Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're given two departments, and the numbers here are the frequencies of the number of years which the employees have worked for the company. So, for example, accounting has 14 people who have worked two years. And we're asked, how do we compare the mean number of years worked by employees for the two departments? Now, what we are going to do is we are going to calculate this, which we'll do in a second. But just taking a look at this, if you had to guess, what would you say is the larger mean or the smaller mean? Well, if we look at accounting, the highest numbers, 19, 14, they're at the lower number of years. Whereas marketing, it seems to be the opposite, right? Where more people are in the higher years. So we would expect for marketing to have a higher mean. Now we can actually find it and we can see if our guess lines up with the actual answer. So doing this, the mean is going to be the total number of years worked divided by the number of people. How do you find the total number of years worked? Well, for example, one year for 19 people would be 1 times 19. Two years for 14 people would be 2 times 14. So we're going to do that all the way down. So this is for accounting. It's going to be 1 times 19 is 2 times 14 plus 3 times 7 is 4 times 8 plus 5 times 6. The number of people we're told is 54 for both of these. If you add all these numbers up on top, you're going to get 130 divided by 54. And this is for accounting. Now for marketing. Similar thing, total number of years worked over the number of people, which again is going to be 54 for both of them. So I can just write that 54 in right now. And again, one year for six people would be one times six, and so on. Two times five plus three times five plus four times 19 plus five times 19. Make sure you can see that equals, equals, adding these numbers all up on top. It's giving us 202 divided by 54. And you'll see now I didn't put these into their decimal forms because it's just not necessary. You can see that 202 over 54 is bigger than 130 over 54 because their denominators are the same. This one has a larger numerator. This means this mean is larger, which we found was marketing, which does line up with the guess we made earlier and also lines up with Answer C, it looks like. Number of means for accounting is less than number than the mean number of years for marketing. So C is gonna be your final answer. As always, thank you for liking and subscribing, and I'll see you in the next video.